Today I'm gonna teach you step by step how to make this kind of edit inside the After Effects. Editor, have you ever imagined having one terabyte of premium files and editing videos like this? With the Creative Pack, you'll get exclusive files to edit in any software, whether on your computer or your phone. Plus, you'll receive eight amazing bonuses, including a program pack, an After Effects pack, an overlay pack, a music pack, and much more. Get your pack now, click learn more. Okay, first I'm gonna create a new composition, so Control N, and I'm gonna just change and the width and the height and will be 10 seconds yeah that's good on my editors pack I have a template for instagram so i'm just gonna just get the composition and put it right here and as you can see yeah that's perfect i'm gonna hide it for now gonna click right here so the rectangle tool holding out click until appear this right here and increase a little bit of the stroke and I'm gonna make something like this. Control Alt Home, Control Home. You can increase the roundness. It'll be something like this. I'll get this icon right here. Press S, decrease a little bit. Press B, and like right here. Control T, you can add a text. I'm gonna be like Snow V effects and change the color. I'm gonna be like right here. I'm gonna add a preset type writer. Press U and you can decrease a little bit of the spacing. Yeah, something like this. Get this shape layer, press S. Click right here to unlink the scale. Click on the clock, the link. A little bit forward and just put zero. F9, go to graph and put this graph right here. I put this text a little bit forward, press T, click right here, put a little bit forward and put zero. Yeah, something like this. Control Y, but white, and put right here. Okay. Click right here, holding shift, click on this one, control shift C, move out and boost the composition, and just click OK. Press an S. A little bit forward and put zero and again f9 and make this graph right here you can enable again uh, the instagram layer enable the 3d for both and put this layer like right here and then just increase a little bit yeah that's good i'm gonna make a new camera so Control alt shift c those are my configs Press B, holding shift, press A, and holding shift, press R, and just enable those keyframes. I'll make a new animation using C. Pressing C, you have those tools right here on your camera. I'm gonna use this one. And just change right here a little bit of the position as well. Something like this. And I guess it's good. F9. And we're gonna make this graph right here. As you can see, you just put a little bit forward. I'll create a new node, so click right here, new no object, control shift D, you can delete this one, and just connect the camera to the node, click right on 3D, press B, enable the keyframe, holding shift press R and enable those keyframes as well. I'm gonna just decrease just a little bit of the scale. Yeah, it's gonna be something like this. Mm, F9, and I'm gonna make this graph. Press T. Click right here and put zero. I'm gonna change a little bit of the graph. I'm gonna make a new camera animation now. Click right here and just make the new animation. It's gonna be something like 
this again get the graph and just change the graph um right here i'm gonna enter the composition go to this title and put the type right there again press u and i'm gonna decrease just to make like this animation right here you know before okay and i'm gonna create an a solid so control y and this is gonna be black and i'm gonna put the effect to see jaws uh put zero on the height change the spikes to robo jaw and but 100 click on the keyframe press u and go like something like this f9 and make this graph right here right here i'm gonna create a solid so control y and i'm gonna put white blank right here press t click on the keyframe but a little bit forward but zero control c and just paste it control v f9 and make this graph right here yeah something like this we can make a new uh judgment blur so control alt y but the s blur like 45 click on the um, keyframe press u and put like zero yeah something like this i can just copy ctrl d and just paste it like right here i'm gonna get solid press s just increase it yeah it's good and i'm gonna also get this right here press t click on the keyframe but zero no but zero control c go some frames forward paste then get this control c and control v something like this it's gonna be this little animation right here I'm gonna paste a uh, color correction preset from my editor's pack. You can duplicate it as well. I just decrease a little bit. Control A, click on the motion blur. Control Shift C, move all the to the composition. And put the effect plus rise time. And put like um, 16. Don't forget to save our project. So Control S. And yeah, that's it. I really hope you like it. Please check my address back. It is really worth it. And thank you so much, guys.